Hey everybody, welcome. My name is Kevin Jones and this is the Beginning Hunter video series here on YouTube. My goal with this program is to educate you and inform you on everything you're going to need to know about becoming a new hunter. So uh, today we're going to be talking about something that I get a lot of questions about, which is um, some of the most basic fundamental parts about the Onyx platform, which are the map tools. Um, so again, onyxmaps.com, you hit the login tab um, after you um, get asked for your information. Um, it will bring you right into the uh, portal. So uh, again, map tools, really basic. This isn't going to be a long video at all. I just wanted to co cover a couple things, basically just three things. Um, again, this is through a my desktop computer at home. This is not through the app on your like smartphone, but if you were on your smartphone, these would be the exact same things. Um, these map tools would still be there. Um, so really quick, um, line distance. Line distance is exactly what it sounds like. What's the distance between right here and right here? So again, all I did was click right here and I can drag and drop from every from anything. So say I'm sitting right here in this piece of um, property and I wanna know how far it's gonna be once I get here to this tree line over here or maybe right here. Um, really easy to do, super easy to do. Uh, so say I'll just leave it right here. I want to know how far it's going to be. You can also um, do additionals. You can do additional, like from there, it's going to be 226 feet to this, and then you can walk up, whatever. Um, once you're done, at least on the desktop version, you have to double click it. Um, up here, you can title it whatever it is that you want to title it. You know, shot. Uh, notes, uh, saw a big deer. Um, you can change line colors. I'm a uh, purple pink kind of fella, so I'm going to choose uh, just like that. Um, you can do styles. Um, you know, it's the, you can just customize it to your heart's content. Um, that one looks cool. Um, and again, it's just your measurement. So, and there it's there, and it will forever be in your content. Um, so that was the first one. Again, line distance. It is the distance between one object and another. Um, area shape. It's really cool. This one's probably one of my favorite ones. Um, so the area shape allows you to draw a polygon um, for an entire parcel of land, and it tells you how many acres are within that parcel. So we'll, we'll give it a start. Again, area shape. You click once, and here we go. See how it starts filling in? And we're going to come down here. See how many, see right there in the center, it tells me how many acres are right there. And again, I double clicked it to close the loop. So that's 28.78 acres. And again, it breaks it down the yards on every single side. So you can title it whatever you want. So I'll say property one. Notes, uh, lots of animals. And again, you can change the color. Again, let's, let's, let's really spice things up a bit. Let's make it all purple today. And then you can do style, weight, whatever you want. Hit save, and again, look at that. Now it saved your entire thing again. Um, so lastly is your waypoint. I use this more than anything. Um, this is so useful. Um, this is one of the main reasons why I got the app is that you can you can keep track of everything, every everything, and you'll see here why. Um, you'll see why here in a second. So again, waypoint, let's continue on with our purple property here. You hit waypoint, and it immediately pops this guy up. So you can um, drag it around, so you get your Latin long, depending on where you're at. This is really useful for those guys who are trying to bring over GPS coordinates from maybe an old GPS and you want to bring it into Onyx. Um, this is one of the ways you can do it. Um, so you just let's just drag and drop right there. And right here we'll say the hot spot. Um, many, many animals. So many, huge, all right. So this right here under types, this is where it's most useful. And again, I use this stuff so often. Um, you can drag and drop, or excuse me, you can select the icon of what you want your um, waypoint icon to look like. So if you put your blind there, right there in the middle of the field, you can put it there. You want uh, that, and again, just to show you some options, I mean, it's, it's pretty unlimited. You can say that there's everything in that field if you want. Um, what I use it for most 
is say I park my truck right there, um, I can save it. And say I saw a deer over here, I could put another waypoint right here, saying that I saw a deer at 2.15 in the afternoon. Um, so again, un unlimited uses out of this, unlimited. Um, so we'll hit save, we'll just say it's the truck. Um, if I wanna add another one, it's the exact same thing. So I'll say deer, oops. And I will find the buck. There he is, and I saw that buck right there on, and it also, by the way, it'll also categorize exactly and keep track of the date and the time and everything that you drop this tab, um, which is really uh, useful as well. Um, so then later on, when you want to, you can click on this. Oops, let me back out of here. And it shows you. So let, let's just say right there, oh, there's property one. It's 28.78 acres, so on and so forth. Oh, that's my my truck, even though we named it the hotspot. But uh, see, I pinned it right there. It gives me everything. If I screwed this up and if I need to edit it later, you can always hit manage. So say I don't want to call my truck the hotspot, which is kind of a weird name for a truck. Um, so I'll just change it to truck. Truck, truck, truck. Save. And then later on, look at that, my truck. Um, so I hope this was useful. Um, again, map tools, line distance, which is the distance between uh, one thing and another, area shape, which is polygon, tells you how many acres are in the middle, and your waypoints, which is your waypoints. It could be deer, elk, water, you know, water source, where you want to park your truck, camp, blind, goose, whatever, whatever it is that you want to put there. Um, so um, if you guys have additional questions about this, um, Easiest way to um, have me actually respond to them is just by leaving a comment. Um, I get notified when there's comments on these things, um, and I will get back to you. Um, so, um, yeah, if this was helpful, let me know. Um, like, subscribe. Um, I'm going to be generating a ton of Onyx content um, because I just think it's the best thing that's happened to hunting in a long time. Um, so, again, yeah, my name is Kevin Jones, and this is the Beginning Hunter video series here on YouTube, and we'll see you next time. Thank you.